last year. Yeah. I never healed, really. So it's still broken. I wrote this one right here, but then like this, the scaphoid is broken at the tip. Those are the one. I guess that bone is the one that uh, doesn't heal. Like yeah. it won't heal on its own because the blood flow isn't enough. But I'll probably get some surgery done after Daytona, but I have a cortisone shot in it right now and getting through. The cortisone is like basically it's a substance your body produces for like anti-inflammatory. Oh, we tested it, Jennings. We got about a half day in there, and that's it for this year.
you and Raspoli can hook up and just get behind him, just push him, just push him, just push him. Get him to get him to go, 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 and get that double bike draft going and see if you guys can break the field. If you guys can break the field, you can just sit there and keep pushing him and pushing him. That last lap, you're in the perfect spot. You know, just be careful if you if you get into that situation where you're in second going into the chicane that they don't chump you and just set up and just come to a stop. So you and I had a chance to speak off camera earlier, but tell me uh, what's going on. We talked in yesterday's broadcast about your, about your hand, about your wrist. Tell me what's going on with that. Well, I broke, the, I broke my scalp on the last year, and I think I'm not sure if it's quite really feeling or not, but I'm going to have to pass out that to the crowd. I'm going to have to pass out that to the crowd. All right, will do. All right, there you go, Scott. Look at this don't let it don't let him get into a drafting situation on that last lap don't let him chump you on the back straightaway don't do if they, if he chumps you you got one option two options one you can stop the whole pack might catch you unless you really got a good lead if you've got just a small lead and he tries to chump you going into the horseshoe you got to go into the horseshoe like there's no tomorrow and you're gonna have to beat him to the line well, I, you know, I talked to Scott about this before. He said, don't shift into like fifth or sixth, let him buy, and then draft right back on. That's that. Basically, what you want to do is drop off NASCAR too. You want to be leaving him and chump him into going in, in, into the chicane and make him have to pass you going into the chicane, and then you get to draft him. Yeah. If you find yourself in the other situation, I mean, hopefully Raspoli's only been here twice. He doesn't know this yet, and he won't know to he won't know to roll off early and make and force you past him. If you see him setting up wide right, be prepared. Then it all breaks down to what your plus is. If you've got a good plus on three, you can try playing okay, the game. Is there a pitboard out there? I can't see it. Okay. Two minutes on the bike. That's not working. Are you sure? Yes. They came by and said it wasn't. Kelly, you got me? Warmer's off. The PA's not working. You're going to do a warm up straight to the grid. Kelly, you got a copy? She can't see her. She can't see the pit board. We got no way to get. Got no way to get any information to Kelly either. You got a copy there, Kelly? The They're coming back. It's a complete restart, but they've just turned the bikes back around on hot pitting, sending them back to us. Elena is telling me she cannot see her pit board. Copy that. No, they're turning around the entire field. I guess they're not satisfied. I mean, they stopped everybody right at the end of pit road and are swinging them back in. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Well, they found more oil. They found more oil. Sorry about that. They found more. Luckily, we weren't one of the first ones. A couple of the first bikes almost fell down in it. When you, 
go by signaling, look for Kelly. I'm gonna have him shake, I'm gonna have him shake the board for you. He says he's in, he says he's in the same spot as yesterday. Did you not see it at all? Right. I'll, I'll have him shake the board so that you, you can pick up his location. Kelly. Do me a favor when she uh, comes around for her uh, warm-up lap and just shake her board so that she can mark your spot. Copy that. Yeah, he's gonna just mark, just try to mark his, try to, try to find a reference point to mark his spot. Uh, I'll make sure that, uh, I'll make sure he's giving you uh, a plus. The, the number that you get is gonna be what's behind you. Uh, you, can, you, can, you can see what's in front of you. And that's the one we want, so we'll let you know what's behind you. Y'all monitor that, but the short, I mean, the stay ready, and they may, they may shorten the race also. So just stay ready. Because, what? Sorry? What are they shorten it to? Well, they may. They haven't said they will. Well, if they, if they did. Is that a lap? I imagine they're probably going to cut two to three off, probably give us a seven lap match, dash or cash. Well, the good news is Tyra will go the distance. <laughs> It's going to be like blasted out. Okay. Unplug, unplug a generator. Kelly, less than two minutes, less than two minutes. She's going to be one of the last bikes out. I just asked, they said they've got no word. At this point in time, let's go, let's go with a 10 lap race. When you come, when you come by, I'm gonna tell you 10 or when you come by after your warm-up. Remember, remember to look for the, the, the lap timer. That's uh, one warm-up lap, and then they go. Yes, sir, and I, I've asked AMA, and they have not said anything. We're still at 10 laps, the best I know. On her board, are you showing her plus the rider behind her? Copy that. I told her just that's most that in the countdown laps the most two important things to worry about. That's all right. These, these three get together. Leave Rispoli out front. Let him set a pace. Yeah, I see that already. Damn it. Yeah, the here now is the, uh, Don't fight. Second pack. Oh, oh yeah. 
What's the gap to the second pack? Less than uh, left belly, I think 10 bike lengths. Not enough. Right. Not enough if they start cutting each other. If they start doing this right here. Everybody wants to lead the damn thing. Where do you want to be? Should be Dyson for second. I wish you'd stay, wish you'd just stay in third and let those yeah, two guys yeah. pull them. Uh, I'm waiting for this group to start fighting. Okay, wait, that's enough. They need to go back to the race. But thank you. Melinda, <laughs> you got to get that helmet off the I'm a mom. You won Daytona. That's crazy. <laughs> Congratulations. What did you do? I mean, we we, we loot. We, you know, I, I lost you when you came through the chicane. I just, I like broke it like the three. When I usually break the two, and hope that some guys are gonna come by me. And then I got the chicane decent, top, and then was in like fourth. Like I held it, like hoping somebody was gonna pass me. I see Corey beneath me. He's not doing anything, so I grab a couple gears and. <laughs> Good job, girlfriend. Good job. Thank you. So she got up on NASCAR. She got up on NASCAR. Thank you. She rolled. She rolled out of it, and they they got up underneath of her. And she said nobody was trying to pass her, so she just got, grabbed the gears and held the gas and out accelerated them. Thank you. 